Um, so, my dear children of Primary 2, we are going to uh, look at another lesson, that's lesson 4 of Mathematics. Uh, the topic now changes. Remember, uh, we've been looking at fractions, but now we are on the next topic called number sequence. Um, we are in our lesson 4 and that is none other than counting in 2's and 3's. We are going to see how can we count in 2's and 3's. So we are going to count in 2's and 3's. Uh, let us look at this chart. Uh, this chart is saying counting in 2's. We are going to start by counting in 2's. Uh, example 1. 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10. Hope uh, this we go on skipping two, two numbers. Here, they are saying here, we keep on adding 2. Because when you have a 0, when you add 2 plus a 0, you get automatically get 2. When you add 2 on this 2, you'll get 4. When you add 2 on this 4, you'll get 6. And when you, when you add 2 on this 6, you get 8 and many others. So, uh, let us look here. Uh, we have here the question saying complete the sequence as our example. We are going to complete the sequence. How does the sequence follow? The sequence says that it starts with 4, 6, 8. They are saying you feel this one, feel this one and feel this one. So here by seeing 4, 6 as the next number, 8 as the next number, it means that these people go on adding 2 to each and every number. So we had 4 at first. They added 2 onto this space. They added 2 plus to this 4 in order to get 6. So they added another 2 to this 6 in order to get 8. They, how now, what is the sequence? It means that our sequence goes on adding 2, 2, 2. So if here was 4, 6, 8, so the next number should be, again we should add 2, because we have been adding 2 since we started. So we say 8, you also add 2 to complete that sequence. 8 plus 2, you will get 8 plus 2. You will count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. Plus another 2 plus 1, 2. What do you get all together? This is a plus sign. What do you get all together? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. You write your 10 here. That is our 10. Remember our sequence is saying that we go on adding 2. 10 plus 2. You will do the working also. You can do the working. 10 plus 2, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, plus 2, plus 1, 2. Let's count all together. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. That's why we write 12. And also, because our sequence tells us to go on adding 2, 2, you also add 2 to this top side that you get 14 as the answer. Uh, let us look at this example 2. Hope you are here. Example 2 is saying find the next numbers in the sequence. What are the next numbers in the sequence? You find that the first number was 3, the second number was 5, the third number was 7, the next number was 9. What is this sequence? What is the flow? of the events here. So here it was 3. Here we see it is 5. So what did they add in order to get 5? What did they add on 3 in order to get 5? So we can see that all oh, this person had 3, 1, 2, 3. In order to get 5 this person did, what, what did this person do in order to get 5? This person added 3 plus, then we add 1, it becomes 4. Not so. 
What if you add another one? It becomes five. So you say, oh, this person added only two to this theory in order to get five. Also five to seven. He only uh, also added two in order to get seven. Five. You remember five plus two, five, six, seven. You get seven. Seven plus two, you get nine. Nine plus two, you get eleven. Eleven plus two, you get thirteen and so on. So it means that here our sequence was to go on adding 2, 2, 2, 2. Try number. Here is also a challenge. It is saying find the next numbers in the sequence. What numbers are here? Find the next numbers in the sequence. But here they started with 12. Uh -huh. The next number was 10. The next number was 8 and the next number was 6. Here, using your mathematics, you can really understand that these people go on deducting, reducing. Here, it is just the numbers are decreasing. So, these people went on deducting. But how many were they deducting? Uh -huh. Two, how many can you move? How many can you reduce from 12 in order to get 10? Uh -huh. Let's see. Uh -huh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. How many can you remove on this 12 in order to get 10? When you remove one, it becomes 4, it becomes 11. When you move another, it becomes 10. So it means that these people reduced, went on reducing it to 2. So, here you say you can simply say that here uh -huh, let, let us do it here it is 12 10 8 and 6 uh -huh. so from 12 let us see uh-huh From 12 to 10, these people, as we have said, from 12 to 10, these people subtracted 2. That is the sign of subtraction. These people subtracted 2 from 12 in order to get 10. They also subtracted 2 from 10 in order to get 8. They also subtracted 2 from 8 in order to get 6. How many can you subtract from 6? When you subtract 2 from 6, how many do you get? Let's see. Uh -huh. Let's see here. You will get 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. When you subtract 2 from 6, what do you get? 1, 2. You will get how many? Let's count. 1, 2, 3, 4. So you will get 4. Come and write 4 here. Uh -huh. Another one. We go on. Remember, we subtract the sequence tells us to go on subtracting 2, 2. Here, we also subtract 2. When you subtract 2 from 4, what do you get? Remember, now we are subtracting from 4. Uh huh. When I have 1, 2, 3, 4, subtract 2, it means that you cancel 2. 1, what do you mean with? Let's count. 1, 2. So here, remain with the 2. The last one is saying, uh, again, we have the last one. Remember, we go on reducing to 2. Now we have 2. 1, 2, they are telling us that the sequence is telling us go on subtracting 2, 2. So, let us subtract 2, 2. 1, 2. What do you mean with? Hope you remain with a 0. Nothing is there. So, write your answer as a 0. So, it then it means that you have passed your prior number. Let us look at our try number next thing. It is saying 12, 14, 16. Pop here numbers go on increasing. Increasing. It means it, the numbers go on adding. But they add by what number? This is 12, this is 14. What do you add on 12 in order to get 14? So 12, 13, 14. It means that you add only 2. So here they added. They added 2. They added 2 on 12 to get 14. How about on 14 to get 16? 14, 
15, 16. They also added 2. Yeah, they also added 2. Uh -huh. So it means that the sequence tells us to go on adding 2, 2. Uh -huh. Here, you should also add 2 because that is the sequence. Uh -huh. 16 plus 2, what do you get? You will count 16, 16, 17, 18. You will get 18. Uh -huh. Then you go on adding 2. Here, the same. I'm using different colors to make it properly seen. Uh -huh. That is, again, we add, when you add 2, you get 18 plus 18. You remember how to count 18, 19, 20. So here, you get 20. Again, we go on adding a 2 plus 2. Remember, 20 plus 2, what do you get? You can count your 20 and then you add 2. What do you get? 20, 21, 22. You will say the answer here is 22. Uh -huh. So thank you for observing this. Uh, let's go to, remember here we have been counting in twos. Let us go to counting in threes. This is another number. Example one is saying uh, complete the sequence, as you know, that is the equation, complete the sequence, 0, 3, 6, 9. Uh -huh. Let us see. What did they add on 0 to get 3? Remember, this is just increasing, it goes on adding. 0 to get 3, what, uh -huh. what can you add on 3 to get 6? Let me see. 1, 2, 3. Uh -huh. What can you add on 3 in order to get 6? 3, 4, 5, 6. Which means that you add also 3 here. You can add also 3. What do you add on? The sequence tells us to go on adding 3, 3. So it means that here they went also, they added 3. 6 plus 3 in order to get 9. When you get 9 and you add 3, what do you get? 9 and add 3. Let us count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Plus, we are going to add 3. 9, 10, 11, 4. Which means that you get 12 as a total. So, here you get your answer as 12. You go on with the sequence. Remember, you go on adding with the rate 3. Rate 3. 12 plus 3, 13, 14, 15. Here you get 15. Don't forget to do your work down. 15 plus 3, 15, 16, 17, 18. You will get 18. So that is example. Um, an example, another example is saying, uh, yes, again, complete the sequence. 2, 5, 8. And others. 2. What did they add on 2 in order to get 5? They added how many? 2, 3, 4, 5. Which means they added 3. Mm -hmm. 5, 6, 7, 8. And also here added 3. So it means that our sequence tells us to go on adding it. 3, 3. Because that is the sequence. Go on adding 3, 3. 8 plus 3, 8, 9, 10, 11. You come and write 11. 11 plus 3, 13, 14, 15. Come here and write 15. Uh -huh. 15 plus 3, 15, 16, 17, 18. Write A. Here it is 14. I have forgotten. When you get 11, when you, you add 3, 11, 12, 13, 14. It is 14. 14. You add 3, 14, 15, 16, 17. Here you get 17. Uh huh. That's it was mistaken, but you don't scribble. You close it once and then you write something neat. Um, now, example 3, and this is our last prime number. It is saying 15, 12, 9. This clearly shows us that numbers are just decreasing. 
numbers are just reducing. It means that we are going to subtract. But we are going to subtract how many? How many are you going to subtract from 15 in order to get 12? 15, 15 to 12. How many subtract? Uh huh. What? You you get probably. Uh huh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. Uh huh. Uh huh. What you subtract in order to get to? Those are fifteen. We subtract one to become six. Fourteen. Another one becomes thirteen. Another one becomes four. So it means that I have subtracted. So go on subtracting three. Uh huh. That is the sequence. Nine, twelve. What is our topic? What are the nine? It is three. So it goes on making our sequence that we go on subtracting three. Nine. When you subtract three from nine, what do you get? Yes. Uh huh. You get. When you subtract three from nine, you get six. Uh huh. When you subtract six, three from six, you get. 3. When you subtract 3 from 3, you will automatically get 0 as your answer. So, uh, my dear children of primary 2, I really thank you for paying attention for this lesson. Uh, thank you for being here. Uh, thank you for consolidating all the concepts that I have told you. Uh, if you want any kind of assistance or you want any help or you would like me to explain more about this concept please you will call me with the number that i gave you in the previous lessons thank you very much we meet the next lesson